Hello aviation lovers, welcome again to our YouTube channel, Aviation2304. In this video, we will discuss Mod 12, Helicopter Aerodynamic Structures and Systems, MCQ questions with explanation. So let's get started. Our first question is, what would an efficient vertical flight mean? A. Low power loading. B. High lift. C. Less drag. D. Less pressure difference? Correct answer is A. In a helicopter, rotor provides thrust force in the vertical direction in order to counter its weight. For an effective vertical flight, the power loading has to be low, which means that the ratio of rotor power required to the rotor thrust should be less. This is achieved by low disc loading. That is, the ratio of rotor thrust to the rotor disc area is minimum. Which of these has the lowest disc loading, A. Quadcopter, B. Helicopter, C. Airplane, D. Cyclocopters, correct answer is, B. The use of high disc rotors for lifting, compromises vertical flight capability, both in terms of power and reduced hover endurance. For all the VTOL aircrafts, helicopters has the lowest disc loading and, thus has the most powerful vertical flight capability. What kind of motion is produced by the hinged blade, which is lying in the plane of a rotor disc? A. Flat motion. B. Lag motion. C. Your motion. D. Roll motion. Correct answer is A. Dot the hinged blade allows rigid body rotation about the hinge point, which is acted upon by the restoring moment due to centrifugal force acting on the rotating blade for the hinge that lies in the plane of the rotor disc. There is an out-of-plane deflection of the blades produced. This is known as flap motion. When the deflection of the blade or long vertical hinge arises, it is known as lag motion. How are the aerodynamic forces of the rotor controlled? A. Feathering motion. B. Lag motion. C. Flap motion. D. Your motion. Correct answer is A. The aerodynamic forces of the rotor is controlled using the pitch motion, which helps in altering the angle of attack of the rotor blade. The change of blade pitch angle is known as feathering motion. This is achieved using hinge bearing, but for rotors without hinge, it is accomplished by the pitch moment about the torsional rigidity region of the rotor blade root. What is the rotor whose blades are attached to the hub with hinges called? A teetering rotor, B, articulated rotor, C, hinge rotor, D, flap and lag rotor, correct answer is, B. There are various arrangements of rotor, based on how the blades are arranged to the hub, for flap and lag motion, in case of articulated rotor, the rotor blades are attached to the hub, with flap and lag hinges, this allows the blade to move independently, with each blade that can either flap, lag, feather, or lead. What values of aspect ratio is generally used for helicopter rotor blades? A. 0. B. Low. C. High. D. 1. Correct answer is C. The ratio of its span to its mean chord is the aspect ratio of a wing. It is equal to the square of the wingspan divided by the area of the wing. Higher is the aspect ratio, more narrow is the wing, and vice versa. A higher aspect ratio wing is generally preferred for helicopters, as it reduces the tip vortices, thus reducing drag. Why are twin rotor configuration used? A. To generate more lift. B. To counter torques. C. To generate pitching motion. D. To generate your motion. Correct answer is B. A twin rotor configuration is used in a helicopter to counter the torque generated by the main rotor. The rotors are counter-rotating with equal size and loading. This leads to no net yaw motion, which can be detrimental. What is the azimuth angle of the rotor blade for a constant rotational speed? A. 0 B pi C pi T D 2 pi T Correct answer is C. The azimuth angle for a rotor blade is given by the angle between 
the downstream direction and the blade span axis. This angle is measured in the direction of rotation of the blade. It is zero in the downstream direction and pi t for a constant rotational speed. What is the value of linear twist rate in general? A. Zero. B. Negative. C. Positive. D. Infinite. Correct answer is B. The rotor blade of the helicopter is twisted along the length of the blade. The linear twist rate is given by the difference between tip pitch and the root pitch, where the pitch is the angle of the blade. This value is mostly negative. Phase lag is due to the blades. A. Inertia. B. Weight. C. Rotational velocity. Correct answer is C. Phase lag refers to the angular difference between the point at which a control input to a rotor blade occurs and the point of maximum displacement of the blade in response to that control input, said displacement occurring in the direction of rotation.